everybody, I have another Hot Wheels to open. This time, it is the First Order Special Forces TIE Fighter from Star Wars The Force Awakens. This is from 2016. These have been re-released. I think there may have been one that just came out in 2018 as well. This is, you know, the kind of deluxe model, a little bigger than your typical Hot Wheels. Costs a little bit more. These are like 5 to $10 maybe, both on eBay and in stores. And it comes with the Flight Navigator, which you saw in my last Hot Wheels uh, review and you can see some of the other ones back there that came in the series so let's go ahead and open this guy up and i do like the tie fighter i don't know why tie fighters look so cool maybe it's because they use 1980 satellite dishes as wings that's pretty awesome let's see there we go coming out of the package finally and let's take the flight navigator out which you can wear like a ring and we'll take the TIE Fighter out that is really stuck in this package. The Force is really holding this one back. All right, there we go. Got it out. And there you can see it's basically a TIE Fighter in black. And I think black looks good on a TIE Fighter. You got a nice antenna so you can get good radio reception in space. A little bit of red on the side. I don't know if I care for the red. I do like the little red dots. It almost looks like a bat. If you look at it that way, but this is a pretty, uh, pretty cool piece. These wings, they feel plastic. I don't think they're die cast. The it said die cast, but it feels more plastically pa plastic. Like I think the middle is die cast, but the wings are more of a flexible plastic, not too flexible. And let's go ahead and take our flight navigator, which I learned last time how to put on. I put it on the wrong, the wrong way last time. And you put it on like that and you can fly it around. So, oops, and it fell off again, even though I learned it. There we go. Now it snapped on. So it has a nice stand. You know, it's pretty tall. And you can compare it to another TIE Fighter. I have the more original style. And I like both. I do, like I said, I like the black. I think these look cool kind of side by side. And actually, this one probably can use the same thing. So let's go ahead and take Kylo Ren's command ship that I reviewed last time off the stand. Wow, those things hold tight. And let's put this guy on. This should fit. There we go. And so you have a little TIE fighter here. We can have the command ship in the middle and a little TIE fighter entourage there. So it's pretty cool. I actually like the look of the black TIE fighter. Again, the only thing I don't care for is some of the red paint on the side. But what you're going to do, that's not a Hot Wheels deal. That's more the design from the from the movies. But like I said, if you want one of these, you're looking probably 5 to $10. I saw some on eBay with free shipping for as low as 5 bucks. So not a bad deal at all. And you might find them at your local Walmart. They might have some of the 2018 versions out there as well. The First Order TIE Fighter, it's pretty cool. I like it. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and I will see you next time.